Hi, my name is Manoli. Uh, this is my second video that I'm doing. And I want to do a little experiment today because I've been asking around and for some reason I can't really get um, a direct answer on how much to stir in the silicone and how it's going to influence uh, the, the size of the cells. So I figured the best way to do it is I'm going to do it myself. Okay. Okay. So first off, I'm going to use black base. Now all my paints are pre-mixed and it's going to be uh, one part uh, master's touch acrylic paint and then two parts Floetrol. Okay. And in here I have this neon yellow and these are each one ounce. Okay. So Okay, I'm going to start with the one to my right, okay? And I'm putting one drop of silicone. Boop. Okay. On that one, I'm going to put one other drop in this one. Okay, so this neon yellow here to my right, I'm only going to stir this twice. So one, two, okay? The neon yellow to my left, I'm gonna stir, we're doing about 10 to 15 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, let's go to 20, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I stirred each one at about the same speed, okay? All right, so I'll put these here, okay? All right, and I'm gonna do two bases, one here, okay? And I'll do another one right there. Okay, now let's get started. Okay. I think this one needs just a little bit more. There we go. Don't mind the cat. All right, start here. All right, again, this neon yellow, one drop of silicone, one ounce of paint uh, total, which uh, that one ounce is made up of a two parts Floetrol, one part uh, Master's Touch. I stirred this two times. Let's see what happens. Okay, I'm gonna wash out this funnel. All right, this neon yellow is the one that I stirred 20 times. I stirred it about the same pace for each one. Let's put it in there. Okay, let's see what's going on here. We'll give it a couple minutes to for the cells to come up. Okay, give it a little torch as well. Okay, so if you look closely, this is the one that I stirred less, and there's a lot of little cells. I stirred this twice, 
okay? I stirred this one 20 times, okay? And as you can see, there's a lot more little cells in this one right here. And this one has the bigger cells. So the more you stir, the bigger, yeah, the more you stir, the bigger the cells are gonna be. The less you stir, you're gonna get a lot smaller cells. Interesting, okay. Let's spread it out a little bit. Okay, that makes sense now. Okay, so that was a pretty cool experiment. All right, so the result, okay? The less you stir, the smaller cells you get. The more you stir, the bigger cells you get. And I finally have an answer and I'm excited to uh, test this out as well as uh, try to see uh, how many different sizes of uh, cells I can get depending on how many times I stir it. So I think I kind of would like something uh, in between this and the next painting. So I'll probably do about 10 stirs, okay? Thank you all for watching, bye.